Mental health, an important issue that's quite often swept under the rug. You feel as if you're stuck in a dark room. You look around for help, but you see nothing. You feel you've exhausted all avenues of assistance. You feel hopeless. But what if you thought outside of the box? And what if you tried something just a little bit different? Welcome to Triple H Equine Therapy, a place where you can heal and where your worries begin to quickly stop. A place filled with beauty and peacefulness in a holistic environment. A place in which you can make a new friend. Anybody who has any kind of mental health issue, whether you've been diagnosed with PTSD or depression or anxiety, can benefit from coming out here. By working with the horses, they benefit physically. They also build that relationship with the horse which helps them socially and emotionally. And then the horse helps them get in touch with their best self, their higher self. So it's a beautiful transformative process. Horses can heal hearts and minds. Where we are lacking services right now um, is primarily for mental health. It's difficult to understand because it's different for every person. Our mental health program is is growing exponentially by the you know by the session basically. And as a society and as a community, Triple H recognizes that that's where the healthcare is lacking. You know, different programs and non-traditional you know treatments and things like that. So we're trying to keep up with that um, by expanding those programs. The majority of the at-risk youth that we're working with um, are in transition. They have such severe PTSD, severe depression, impulse control is non-existent, you know, things like that. So the best thing for them is to be in one of these residential facilities um, where they have professionals. We have a lot of kids come into this program that have a really difficult time trusting anyone. They've had a lot of issues in their life. So we see these kids grow leaps and bounds in eight weeks. Um, I can't tell you how many of them have told me, you know, when I came here, I didn't trust anybody. And through a relationship with my horse, I feel like I can trust people again. Our at-risk youth program is all based on developing healthy relationships. And we teach the kids overcoming fear, having good, healthy boundaries, um, and we do that through a relationship with a horse. And then our hope is that they go into their real life and practice all of those good relationship skills with people. The other biggest population that we work with um, for mental health is our veterans. These are, these are men and women who have had severe trauma somewhere. And it's not as easy, you know, as, as people think to sit across from somebody and talk about some of the most innermost thoughts that you experience every day. Uh, my name is Jared Chambliss, and uh, I was four years active with the U.S. Army. I started as a volunteer about 18 months ago. Uh, as a participant, I was prepared with Gemma, which was interesting because the first class as a volunteer I did, the participant I work with was also paired with Gemma. You know, when you see people who are confined to a wheelchair six days out of the week, they don't need help getting up out of their wheelchair, they just stand up. I mean, literally you never know when you're out here what you're going to see. You don't know what small miracle you get to witness and be a part of. And so, as a veteran who struggles with transitioning from active back to civilian, uh, Sometimes it's hard to, uh, there's not a whole lot of things I look forward to. And uh, coming out here is one of those things. Yeah, I mean, I, I love it here. I love the staff. Uh, it's just a good group of people, a great organization. Sometimes life knocks you down. As hard as it may be, the best thing that you can do is to get back on that horse and ride. 
and look to those who want to help.